Continuous delivery helps teams deliver software at the click of a button. Every part of the software delivery process is automated, from check-in to production. This includes the application code, configuration, the infrastructure, and database changes, really everything. One way to visualize continuous delivery is to imagine a factory assembly line where cross-functional engineers work on various parts of the software as it moves along in its life cycle. Now in the past, teams might only deliver software every few months or so. It's because of manual error-prone processes. Often, pieces of the delivery package go back and forth between teams separated by silos. This is a long, drawn-out, and expensive exercise with the final package assembled at the 11th hour with teams vowing to never repeat it again. With continuous delivery, software can be delivered several times a day, once a week, or as often as you want. It's always in a releasable state. When compared to traditional delivery methods, Continuous delivery offers two key advantages. The first is the software is always ready to release, meaning you don't stop and make a special effort to release the software. The second is that there aren't any walls between the teams. Instead, there are delivery teams that are made up of developers, testers, DBAs, operations, and so on, all contributing to a single path to production. So we're not just talking about developer changes here. So no matter if the change is a change to the infrastructure, the data, or whatever, the entire package gets built tested, analyzed, and deployed. When it passes all these checks, it becomes a release candidate that could potentially be released to users, if the business chooses to do so. Now, when a problem is discovered, quick feedback notifies team members that something's wrong and they need to fix it, and the assembly line stops. This is when poly-skilled experts fix the issue, scripts are updated, and when all the acceptance criteria are met, moves along in the path to production. So in summary, continuous delivery is concerned with all parts of a software system and how all team members work as a part of the single path to production. This way, software gets to users quicker and in a more predictable manner.